Hello. My name is becoming less and less important. But I am still a human being. And for the grace of God, by the grace of God, I'm breathing, walking, talking, looking at you, thinking, moving, eating, all that stuff. And I must say I'm grateful. I have begun to see the truth about my life and myself and my choices and my responsibility, you know, I have begun to understand that many of the things that I've done in my life were wrong, that I've failed so many tests put in front of me, but all of this pain and suffering has of that and the fact that I pray and beg the Lord to please give me some understanding, some strength, some wisdom, some courage, some, you know, all the things you need to go on and begin to help yourself so that you can possibly help someone else. And I've realized that uh, the things that we need that I need, society that I look around and see seem to need, don't come from, I, I don't know where they come from, man, they come from inside of your heart, you know, and, you know, there's a lot of things I don't like. A lot of things I complain about, and a lot of things I, you know, and sometimes you just have to get this stuff off your chest to get it out. You have to. However, what I did with all this negative stuff was train myself to see the world and myself in a negative way, and that's not the best thing that we can do for ourselves. Um, Things in my life recently have been so contrived, so perfectly staged that, like I said, it's impossible for one person to make their own life so unmanageable. It takes help, and I've had it. But, you know, there's also people out there who care. Now, I know there's those of you who like to watch me scream and yell and cry and die because it makes you feel good inside, and I'm sorry. It's okay. I still love you. And I forgive you. Because who am I? You know? But... Change in the world is only going to come from a change in us. And I'm not going to be here to make it all happen. So I'm just sharing my experience and strength and hope. I do have hope. Even though hope is really hard to find at times. lost, I'm broken, I'm sick, I'm dying, I'm spinning around, but here I am, still trying not to hate, not to hurt, not to want revenge, not to be angry, and that's a really hard thing, but I try, I know I'm no 
Christ figure, you know, although I may be martyred. Put your hands on my head and give me your sin and offer me up. What choice do I have? And I realized that life really is a whole series of choices and they're all there behind me like a you know connected together one after another and I'm pulling them along with me wherever I go and there's only one oh, I, I take that back there's two first I need to forgive myself and others and then to pray for forgiveness from him. I don't know. I just wanted to share that. blessed to be able to and thank you for caring. Just do the best you can all the time. Shoot for the higher purpose, for the middle pillar, for the purity of motive and heart. And the temptation will always be there. Frequently it will win, but one day, perhaps, we'll learn how to avoid those temptations and trials. If not, anyway, God bless you. Thanks for watching. Uh, one more thing. I'm supposed to go into the hospital today for monitoring of epileptic seizures to see if I'm having epileptic or non-epileptic seizures. And, you know, my uh, left parietal lobe of my brain has suffered a microvascular ischemia. In other words, my brain is dying uh, from what etiology they can't say, but I'm pretty sure it's a, a combination of things. Uh, a million bites from crazy insects, immunosuppression, uh, bad diet, lack of exercise, brain trauma, too much medication, um, you know, more gallons, the whole nine yards and they're using on us. So, folks, I don't know, it may be too late for a lot of us. It may be too late for all of us, I don't know. But, uh... As long as you're still breathing, there's still a chance. And as long as you're still loving, there's hope. And as long as you can reach out and care for others that you would... You know, it's hard. But... Anyway, enough chatter. Thanks for watching. God bless you all.